Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel, the Cyvone Pro. I have something very special for you today coming to you from touchswipe.com and we have in front of you a TX2Z touchscreen laptop with Ubuntu 9.10 or Ubuntu which is Linux and uh, we've got the touchscreen working on it uh, which was really easy to do and I've put it in the forum and uh, you can go ahead and check out our um, our way of doing this in our forum we have the instructions it was very easy to do you just do it through terminal as you can see you've got all the effects and touch screen works great and the touch pen works now really important I couldn't get these effects which is known as compiz uh, and the reason is is because of the ATI or the Broadcom or whatever the Radian um, video graphics for the computer they were stopping it from working so in the same post as far as getting the touchscreen to work with the Ubuntu in Linux um, I went ahead and put the opportunity to install a new graphics pack it's very easy to do and that will get all the effects working for you because you want to be able to do the, all the cool 3D stuff like the cube here, which is cool, all touch. And uh, yeah, it's just really got some neat stuff here. It's very touch friendly. And um, I've got, it's called Grab or something like that for Firefox. So you can, you know, obviously you can touch scroll as well. So, I mean, everything works great. There's no multi-touch. Uh, I'm going to work on that, try and find that, and that way we can get that to you. Um, but, you know, as you can see, it's very awesome. A lot of people want to know how to do this. It's complicated almost everywhere you go. Uh, but the link I'm going to leave here is going to make it so easy for you. And what I'm going to suggest that you do is burn the disk for Ubuntu 9.1.0 I think at the end of the month they're gonna have a new 10.0.4 version which is supposed to be better uh, but it's in a beta right now so who knows but anyway for this uh, just what I suggest you do is burn the disk for Ubuntu and um, run it within Windows in other words start up Windows run the disk you're gonna see an option that says wubi.exe click that and when you click that, it'll let you install Linux directly through Windows, almost like an application. That way you don't have to worry about all the partitioning and everything else. It does it all for you. It's a one-click step. It installs a dual boot for you. Uh, and it's it's so easy a, a kid could do it. So I suggest using Wubi, EXE, you know, and then come down to touchswipe.com. If you're not already joined with your touchscreen with your TX2Z, join up or TX2 anything should work uh, and you will have Ubuntu Linux touchscreen enabled and you'll have a lot of fun with it and really I've just gotten involved with uh, experimenting with Linux Linux excuse me and uh, I'm really enjoying it I like it just you know almost as much as Windows 7 uh, if not better I mean I, I've discovered a lot of really neat things and I'm, I know I'm just barely breaking the ice with it um, a lot of fun. I had to get the sound working, which was pretty easy to do using Google. Um, I had to get Flash working, which, I, again, I had to use Google, which was still pretty easy. Uh, all this is done through the terminal, which is cut and paste. And it's really easy to deal with, and you can do a lot of neat things with the operating system using terminal. Um, but having the touch screen really makes it a whole new animal. You know, being able to do all these cool things with it, it's just really awesome. So, I definitely suggest getting Linux Ubuntu 9.10 and definitely use Wubi EXE to install it. makes it easy. Then come down to touchsleep.com, use my link here in the video. You're going to be able to install it probably within about no less than, no more than five minutes. And uh, your touch screen will be working. So uh, enjoy. I hope you enjoyed the video. Please rate me, subscribe if you like us, and uh, good luck. Let me know if you have any questions. Thanks a lot, YouTube. Have a great day.